Well, now at 10 o'clock tonight, an eviction of seniors in Westwood is being called the largest in L.A. history. More than 100 seniors are now being forced to find a new home. A company is turning their high rise into luxury apartments. Tonight, KCAL 9's Tom Waite is live at the building in Westwood where seniors met tonight to see what they can do. Tom. Yes, yeah, Susie and Jeff, a lot of very, very emotional seniors here tonight. Some are 80, 90, even 100 years old and now probably forced to find a new home. They say this is their family and they don't want to go. I'm happy here. I don't want to leave. I don't have the energy to move. 95-year-old Dorothy Altshuler faces eviction. She's among around 150 tenants of Westwood Horizons who were told a new company bought their building and they want everyone out so they can transform the tower into a luxury high-rise. This is a fine place. I'd like to stay as long as I'm alive. What we're here tonight to do is to give an overview of the process. Tenants met to hear their legal options, and there are few. The council member who represents the district says the seniors are eligible for a year extension, but beyond that, these seniors will likely have to find a new home. There's no good excuse for this. Uh, we're trying to look at every legal angle to see what we can do to stop it. The seniors say notices were posted on their doors last week, telling them they have until the end of March to move. The reason? Watermark Retirement Communities is taking over. They want to renovate the building, which they say could take two years. The rents are also expected to rise. I'm a wreck, and I'm usually very able to cope with situations, but this is a very difficult one to, to cope with when the president of Watermark, which is a big company, comes out and says, you all have to evacuate this building. Money, money's a big thing here. Isaac Benjamin is an Army veteran who served in World War II. He's lived in the building for four years. Veterans of that war, nobody cared about money at that time. Everybody fought for the country. Now you get some people who are interested in money, grabbing, a, chasing out these, the widows and the brothers and sisters are veterans, and that's wrong. The company taking over apparently intends to keep this a senior care facility, but because it's senior care and not just apartments, that could change the rental classification on the building, complicating things even further for these seniors. Right now, it does not appear there are many legal options. They almost certainly face eviction. Reporting live in Westwood, let's go back to you, Susie and Jeff. Okay.